life on Earth. An amazing array of plants and animals involved here. Evolution is the idea that unifies all of biology. Evolution and the Tree of Life provide the intellectual framework of UC Berkeley's Department of Integrative Biology. Integrative biologists observe and explore life through time to understand the processes and outcomes of evolution. We study all of life, its biology and behavior, from bacteria to humans. We do so from multiple perspectives, genes and molecules, physiology and morphology, individuals and populations, ecology and ecosystems. How have humans evolved and adapted to diverse or extreme environments? How have other species and habitats changed over time? And what might that mean for life in the future? It's a holistic approach to doing science and to understanding our world. What distinguishes integrative biology at Berkeley? Well, we pioneered the discipline in 1989. Faculty chose to join integrative biology from multiple departments at Berkeley, ranging from anatomy to zoology. The breadth of our faculty and student research is unmatched, a diversity as rich as the natural world itself. I had little idea about biological research until I worked in two integrative biology professors' labs as an undergraduate. That experience helped focus what I would go on to study and how I opened my lab to students and their ideas. Collections in our four campus museums and a 34-acre botanical garden serve as critical archives of biodiversity. Our biologically rich state becomes an outdoor classroom for field-based, hands-on learning for current students as well as alumni. Our research occurs in UC Natural Reserves across California, as well as environments around the world. The UC Natural Reserves at White Mountain and here in the Santa Ynez Valley are essential for my work on insect physiology and ecology. The world-class facilities attract students, faculty and visiting researchers to do science in the natural environment. Research also happens in dozens of faculty labs. My lab investigates brain plasticity. We've discovered that the brain has the capacity to reverse damage following injury or aging and restore healthy and youthful capabilities. By studying rockfish, a diverse group with a range of longevities, we can gain new insights about how aging occurs, both in these fish and in ourselves. Our faculty, researchers, and students will keep learning from evolution's innovations so we can understand humanity's place in nature and improve our health. Help sensitive species adapt to the impacts of climate change. Design agile robots able to handle difficult and dangerous tasks. Inspire tomorrow's explorers of life through inclusive classes that enable new discoveries. Help light the way to research and teaching in nature for more students than ever before. Join the Friends of Integrative Biology today.